everybody. I am so happy for you to be with me today. I would like to introduce to you one effective method in doing something. The law of detour accumulation. The hawk does not choose a course, the shortest way, but the course, the farther way because it takes shorter time to get to the target. If you use acceleration of gravity, the speed will accelerate to two times as fast as the normal speed. Life is the same as the hawk's flying. The time for learning new things is a kind of accumulating time. Such accumulation has to be repeated. If you want results, you have to work, invest, devote and make an effort. You can finally start planning only when you select the result you want and find where to go. You are an architect to create your image. Proceed forward anywhere at any time. Don't worry about what other people think about things you can do and cannot do. Believe in yourself and your ability. With self-confidence, challenge your current status. It is your life. It is the life proceeding one step at a time every day. Self-giving loss takes place during the detour accumulation period, which was proven scientifically by the cycloid curve. There is no revenue without investment and no result without effort. When you are young, Learn enthusiastically and implement what you learn. What is my callus? The first photograph is for some of the ballpoint pens of person who passed an examination for CPA used for the examination. There is a common law that a person who exercises in writing answer papers of as high as his or her height for the subjective questions writing a thesis will pass the examination undoubtedly. This is a picture proving the law. The second photo is of the palm of Kwangsum Kim, a baseball player of LG professional team. He was a pitcher but he had to turn into a hitter because he broke his shoulder. So he had to exercise at least twice as much as other players did, which made the palm callous. There is no free lunch at any events. Let's think about what my callus is. Let's make our own detour accumulation. Completion of construction in 1999, 321 meter high, the highest hotel in the world, only one seven star hotel in the world.
Revival of Arab Sailboat, Dow. What Tom sketched with just three lines was transformed into a beautiful building on the place with just water and sand. Based on a mere sketch at first, model picture was drawn and then blueprint and then progress scheduled, and then they built a beautiful hotel a lot of people are using. The purpose of navigatorship program is to sketch a person's own life. If you make a life blueprint, you can imagine how your life shall be developed. If you execute the blueprint, your life will come true as the blueprint. In order of why, how and what, why to live first, and then how to live, and then what to do. What is the difference between children and adults? Adult is a giving person and children is a taking person. If you dream of a meaningful future, you have to think about what to give before you think about what to take. I would like to introduce to you a story of Bangja. Since the reason for all things is given to me, the pleasure will be greater than anything if you do your best for what you are doing now. You are a designer to design your own future, a constructor to build your own fate and a painter to draw your own life on a white paper. As Lincoln said, a human being can be happy on as much level as he or she would like to be happy. Your mental attitude and thought is important. Thought makes action, action makes habit and habit makes life. Therefore, thought is the most important thing in everything. The world is getting different according to whether you are positive or negative. In a Korean TV program recording knowledge through radio waves, a child asked a question, this is very small, but has almost everything in it. What is this? There were many answers, but the correct answer was a seed. After a small seed is planted, it grows to a big tree and renders food and fruits. Similarly, there is a seed of thought for human beings. Life voyages could be different according to the thought. A person who thinks happy thoughts can get the fruit of happiness. I would like to introduce a story of a three-year hill. While an old person passed a hill, a young man was crying. Hi young guy, why are you crying? I tumbled down this hill, and then saw a sign saying if you tumble once on this hill, you can live just three years long. It is just unfair for a promising young man like me. The old man strongly suggested to him, don't worry. If you tumble 30 times more, then you can live 90 years more. A thought of three years of life when tumbling once on a three-year hill is so different from a thought of 90 years of life for tumbling 30 times on the same hill. Positive thinking draws positive results. Dr. George Wilton, psychiatrist, Massachusetts Hospital said, 40% of apprehension does not come true. 30% of apprehension is for what has happened already. 22% is just for mere things, 4% is uncontrollable by yourselves and just 4% is for what you can change. Therefore, you need to think positively rather than to apprehend. If you let people of an experiment group take a medicine without any remedial effect saying that it is a medicine causing headache, 70% of the people will get a headache. It is called the nocebo effect. There is an opposite phenomenon, the placebo effect. If you let patients take medicine without any remedial effect saying those are miracle cures, they could be cured. The fact that a dream comes true according to one's thought was proven scientifically. Why don't you try to define life for a while? Please stop this video for about 5 minutes and think about this slide and try to fill in the table. Inamori Gazuo, chairman of Kyocera said, a life is painting a picture with a brush of thought on a canvas of the world. I would like to introduce an old Chinese saying, as there is a wind and a cloud in the sky, in our life, there is a fortune and a misfortune which changes in the morning and the evening. There is a sacred duty given to everybody. People have to exert themselves to live doing what they would like to do in the life given only once. If death has an eye on you, you have to take care of your life more beautifully and more flagrantly and leave beautiful inheritance. What kind of fragrance are you blowing out? 
What kind of appraisal are you getting after you die? What kind of inheritance are you leaving? A lot of flowers blow out their own fragrance. However, it does not envy or interfere with others. After the flower goes to seed, it leaves the seed as inheritance. A human being has his or her own fragrance. While there are people with beautiful fragrance, there are one giving off bad smells. While there are people who make a beautiful world together, there are ones who give off bad smells to be alive alone. People who live beautiful lives have four fragrances. Basic fragrance, material fragrance, psychological fragrance and social fragrance. Basic fragrance plays a role like the foundation for a building is one indispensable to life. Psychological fragrance means dream and challenge, affirmative thinking, persistence and self-esteem, etc. as one indispensable to a happy life. You must achieve it by challenging yourself with a big dream. Only with a dream you cannot give off fragrance, but challenging life does. Water does not boil until 99 degrees, but from 100 degrees. Nevertheless, most people give up after 99 trials at the last minute. Lastly, you must love yourself. Unless you have self-esteem, other people do not have any reason to respect you. Mental fragrance lets the value of being appear. Social fragrance is a virtue necessary to live together. The world of trusting, communicating, sympathizing, and considering each other is a beautiful life. A closed relationship without communication does not last long. You can communicate only when you open your heart first and communicate not only with tongue but also with heart. You reap what you sow and what goes around comes around. You must hold out your hands first and emit a sweet fragrance. Though anybody does something first to make a world people live. Flowers get wet but fragrance does not. Flowers get wet but color does not. People die but their fragrance will remain in the heart of alive people. Let's make an errand that the basic fragrance, the material fragrance, the psychological fragrance and the social fragrance govern the world.